So I wanted to get on here quickly to share with you guys some great news in regards to Apple's next major software release, iOS 26.1, currently sitting in beta 4. I've had some time to actually test this software on my primary device, the iPhone 17 Pro Max, and I have some great news that I wanted to share with you guys. Keep in mind, this software update will bring a lot of new features and changes and improvements to your iPhone, including changes to liquid glass, the ability to change the look of liquid glass, faster animations on your device, and a lot of new features that iPhone users have been wanting for quite some time. Now, if you want to learn more about everything that's new within iOS 26.1 so far, I'll link down below my beta coverage. You can go ahead and watch that right now if you wish to do so. However, I wanted to quickly shift my attention over to another small software update that Apple is currently working on that should be released before their next release 26.1. So Apple is working on a small software update iOS 26.0.2. Now, we've been waiting for Apple to release this software update since last week. Now, Mac Rumors has confirmed that iPhones running iOS 26.0.2 has been visiting their website for nearly a week now, perhaps even more than a week at this point. They did mention last week that they expect this software update to release late this week. So it is Thursday the 23rd. I'm expecting this software to release as early as tomorrow on the 24th. I'll keep you guys posted the minute this software becomes available. I'll make sure to make a video for you guys. We're expecting iOS 26.0.2 to include security patches and more bug fixes for iPhone users. There's still some reports of choppiness, battery drain, and so on. So let's go ahead and dive right into this video because I want to talk about one thing that I think most users are going to be happy to learn about in regards to the next major release, iOS 26.1. So as I mentioned, iOS 26.1 is currently sitting in beta 4. The beta was released just a couple of days ago, and Apple is currently on a weekly release schedule for betas. So there's two scenarios in regards to expected release day. So let's go over the two scenarios here. So I'm expecting Apple to release perhaps the fifth beta for iOS 26.1 next week. If that was to happen, we can expect an official release sometime in mid-November the RC probably on the week of the 3rd and the official release on the 10th of November for iOS 26.1. Now scenario number 2, which is also a possibility, we could see iOS 26.1 RC the last week of October and perhaps the first week of November, November 3rd, we could see the official release, but I think it will release on November the 10th, which is a Monday, and I think next week we get another beta or perhaps the RC a week in between with nothing and then the official release. That is just my guess, but again, I'll keep you guys posted. I don't think it's going to go past November the 10th that we see iOS 26.1 officially released to the public. So the good news that I wanted to share with you guys in regards to iOS 26.1, the current beta, is in regards to battery life. And this is one of the most common questions that I get. Now, oftentimes I don't like to judge the battery life on an iPhone when I'm running beta software, but at this point, it seems like battery life has gotten so good since the first beta for iOS 26.1 to now that I feel like I wanted to share these details with you guys and hopefully this will translate out to the official release. So right now I've been putting this iPhone to the test and I've been getting amazing on-screen time heavy use tried to charge only to 50% and let it roll all overnight and it looks like the battery life has improved quite dramatically since the initial release of iOS 26 so far with beta 4 I have to say this has been the greatest battery life experience so far in iOS 26 with the latest beta 4. And again, I wanted to put this video out to talk about the battery because I know a lot of users will most likely update to iOS 26 and one of the main concerns is going to be battery life. So, so far with beta 4, the great news here is that battery life has been the best out of all the software releases and all the betas for iOS 26. So I'm happy to report that. So stay tuned here to the channel again. We're expecting iOS 26.0.2, the next minor update in order to address more security issues and bugs on the iPhone and then after that perhaps mid to late November we can expect iOS 26.1 as the next major release. And there you guys have it just a quick update. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.